So today I'm here to teach you how to create an animation to follow a path with the text. So let's jump into the computer and let me show how you can do it. So here we are inside of DaVinci Resolve in the edit page and let me play. So this is the technique that I'm gonna show you. As you can see, the text is following a path over here and let me show you how you can do it. So you can start it here in the edit page by just dragging a text plus node over here. You come to the text plus node and you type whatever you want. In this case, I'm gonna put text sample, for example, I'm gonna change here the font, the type, let's change, let's give it something, a different color, something like this. And you come here to the layout and come here where it says type, change it to path. Now you can't draw any path over here. So you can come over here to this symbol. So it's the symbol of the fusion. So it's, it opens our text in the fusion page. You, you click it and it opens in here and it comes with this node, the template and the media out. So now we can come here. As you can see, we already have here a cross. So let's, if I click it over here, for example, something like this, like this, like this, and like this, we have a path and you have it here, here, the position of the path. And now we can animate it. Of course, you can come here and adjust here the handles. Over here, do the same for this one, for example. And now if we animate it, for example, we can animate it with the keyframes or if you want, you come here, right click, modify with and anim curves. You come here to the modifiers. In, in the curve, I like to use custom because let's go to the first. As you can see, we have here something visible and I don't want that. So let me put it like this. Let me adjust it like this. So now it's here, let's go to the end. Let me adjust this also and let me move it like this. And now if I play it, we have our text moving over here and it's done. So this is one way. And if not, if we go to the edit page, we can see our text animated or you can do it in a different way. You can come here, right click, new fusion composition. Let's type text sample. Let's open the text sample in the fusion page and we have our media out. We just gonna need to add a background. Then I like to put the background, the alpha to zero. And now just add a text, connect our text over here to the background, to create the merge. Then you can do the same. Let's type text sample. Let's change also the font, the type and the color. And now we go to the layout and do exactly the same. Select path. Now you can draw your path. For example, something like this like this, and like this. And it's done. Now we can, you can adjust everything here. So let's adjust something over here. Do exactly the same over here and just like this and it's done, but you can create more complicated path. As you can see, I didn't finish, but if, if I do it like this, I can finish and close. And now the path will do this and you can animate it with the same technique or with keyframes or with uh, modifiers and with anim curves. So as you can see, you have multiple ways of animating your text to follow the path that you want. So as you could see, it's very easy. And now you can put your text moving around and follow a certain path. 
And I hope this information was helpful. And I hope you learned something today. And if yes, don't forget, hit that like button that helps a lot. Subscribe if you're not subscribed yet. And hit that notification bell to be notified next time I launch a video. Until then, bye.